Hey you! So I finally decided to get back into fitness. This time with my bike. Welcome to my hometown, the city of Danao. And welcome to my first bike adventure club. Hey you! So it's a beautiful Saturday. Actually, it's a gloomy Saturday. And guess what? Finally, I will be riding my bike again after like five months. It's May 15 today. The last time I rode on my bike was on January 1 with Coach Dalton Simon. Shout out. Today, um, it's afternoon already and we're planning to ride all the way to Danao City, my hometown. So this is probably my first long ride. And we'll see how this goes. Wish me luck. Buyers! And I'm motor <laughs> And then there are motorcycles. <laughs> you really need to be careful and always put safety as top priority. The best part, the weather is cooperative. It's not really that hot. It's not even sunny. It's not this wind, but still okay. Let's go. Welcome to Compostela. Let's go. Go. It's the now.
we're in Mojo Bistro Cafe in Danao and we just had dinner. And since we don't have a lot of time, we have a lot of we just had to wait it out. And now that it's already drizzling, I think it's the best time for us to leave. But the thing is, it's already dark, so we need to make sure that we the bike. Ta -da! Ta -da! of the street still in the now and guess what we're waiting for a bus no I'm just kidding <laughs> we had to do a quick stopover so we can check the GoPro so we can have additional shots for the vlog buyers Hey you! So I'm finally back home. Super tired and exhausted, but I had so much fun today. I can't sleep yet, so I'm having my milk. Shout out to the coffee potion. I begin to realize a lot of life lessons from today's activity. One is when you do an activity or when you take on any endeavor, you have to come prepared. If you're a student, if you want to, or if you're going to take an exam, or if you're at work, and you are due for a deadline or a presentation, you really have to take time to prepare, right? Otherwise, you're setting yourself up to fail. So you have to put in the effort, much like today. I mean, I should have put the effort into preparing before that long ride. You know, I should have practiced and trained. Hence, ayun, that struggle. But I had fun. Second is, you know, life sometimes will throw you a curveball. Things that you do not expect. Siguro today, it wasn't expected because it was like a spur of the moment kind of thing from last night and we decided to go on a ride today. Pero even so, pag may mga nangyayari sa buhay na hindi mo expect as much as you want to prepare for everything, there will be times na life will throw curveballs at you. The same approach as today, since andun ka na, napasubo ka na, you just have to keep on going and never give up. There will be times na kailangan mong magpahinga. There will be times na kailangan mong unupo at huminga ng malalim. Take a rest, take a pause. Eventually, you still have to stand up and continue to move forward. It's a never give up attitude na kailangan natin. And that's very important in life. The last one is, you have to enjoy the ride figuratively and literally. I realized actually na the ride today was only the fourth ride I did where I had company. And I've only had my bike for like less than a year and probably went on more than 30 plus rides. The majority of which I did in Manila. Can I realize ko no, na although cycling is an individual activity or is an individual sport, it's something that you will enjoy more if you do it with friends. Kasi alam ko meron din mga tao na gusto mag maging siklista because you know they can internalize, they can have time for themselves. To me, 
I enjoy it more when I have friends with me. And if I relate that to life, you will have to enjoy life more if you have company. So for me, even if I'm alone in this house because my family is away, I realize na hindi naman ako lonely because maswerte ako na ang dami kong friends and that's how I enjoy the ride of life. So, if there's any key takeaway here is that you have to enjoy the company of your friends and, you know, be thankful for the people that are around you. Because like I always say, mantra ko nga, you have to be your own hero. But sometimes heroes will get tired and you can always draw energy from the friends that you have. Thank you to all my friends. Buyers! This is the best.